Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Praveen Kumar Bumiset. In this video, I'll cover how to create a metallizers in Snoptech so by using DBT. With the help of DBT, I want to create metallizers in Snoptech. So point is that what directly we can't able to create. With the help of models, we can't able to create. Okay. With the help of macros, we can able to create them metallizers in Snoptech from DBT. Okay. So before that, let me understand what is dbt macro it's a piece of sql code that can be reused same as udfs and procedure so main purpose of dbt is what reusability purpose okay it's a piece of sql code that can be reused syntax is like this so macro macro name the arguments and our logic will goes here and end macro this syntax macro mac why we're discussing because with the help of models we can't create metal issues by using macros we can able to make it work so we need to know how to call a dbt macro that is a dbt run hyphen operation and the macro name so with the help of this we can able to execute the macro okay let's discuss in detail how we can create metrics views okay hold for one second okay so we are logging to snowflakes now so here first we should have table and some record should be there. if i want to create metal issues compulsory table should be available okay so this is my table select start from rav dbt table okay so it contains three record now requirement is that what i want to create a metal issue syntax is so create create or replace so metalized metalized to view Okay, view name, suppose EMV. Okay, okay, as select start from so proud DBT table. Okay, see, this is my syntax create or replace metal issues view name. Okay, as select start from the same. Before that, let me confirm whether this view is available or not. Yes, show views like. Okay, so see this view. So view is not available okay so with the, from the dbt i want to create this function for this purpose what let me go to dbt cloud open with the same thing first use the macro macro so we can put so create metalized view macro okay so this is my macro and put the logic okay see the same okay save it so save it with the macro name where exactly we should save in the macros folder so control v dot sql so create now what i say now we need to run by using command word dbt run hyphen so see so dbt run hyphen operation and the macro name control v now see what happened now see it is getting success but what happened let me go back to the snowflake and see what here so view is not create so reason is that what okay see so reason is that what okay see uh, directly the detail statements cannot be executed so we should do some setting okay see first we should do the set we need to set one variable so setting and end set so this is important if i want to perform detail compulsory we should set and the end set okay see setting so this entire statement we are putting in this variable and we should use the run command so see run query and we need to pass the variable okay first we'll see then it begins so save it so run what's the command so dbt run hyphen operation and the macro name okay so micro we can copy and paste now go back here and confirm see what happened show views so now view has been created from db see one more time let me drop this view drop metalized view for confirmation purpose i'll explain one more time so that we get comfortable okay see as of now no views are available okay let me go back here okay open one more session so what is in tags macro okay see so memories creation macro so this is my macro name control c control s control dot sql save in macros folder okay. 
create. Now, what is the syntax for table? Okay, so, so see, copy the same functionality. Control C. Okay, and put inside this slash. Okay, so create or replace view. So what is you know directly we can't table text good. We should put in setting and end setting. First we should set this variable. You can give any name. I can give my name for a week. Okay, so this is my variable. Okay, setting and we should do end set. Okay, now what happens? See the same thing. So this entire statement is storing in this variable. Now how to run the statement? We should go for what concept? So do run query. So this is the way we can able to know what happened. So I can give any name, dbt trainer. Okay, anything you can give. Same thing we can put here. Okay, see confirmation purpose, we go to Snowflake. As of now, no views are available. Okay, go to dbt. Okay, save it. Okay, what's the command? So dbt run hyphen operation and the macro name. So copy the macro and execute the same. So confirmation go to Snowflake. Now see what happened. Okay, see view has been created. Now how to confirm it's a normal view or metalized view. Scroll it bit, right? See here, two commands is okay, two column. Is secure, is metalized. Is metalized is to nothing but say, metalized views has been created. So directly we can't able to create with the help of models. We should go for macros concept. If I want to create metalized views, go for macros concept okay so this is one of the use case in real time it work the metal as you some purpose if you like the content subscribe and share the channel thank you for watching